What is it, Mingwa? Her Highness is sleeping. The princess ran a fever, so Chancellor Zhao ordered us to bring her some medicine and make sure she drinks it. Right now? But she's sleeping. You're going to wake her up? The princess fell asleep if that If you fast. wake up the princess and then... she gets even sicker, I will... personally seek an audience with the Emperor to get you punished! Wow, Chua. You really are very loyal to the princess. The princess is our mistress. All our lives belong to her. Of course I'm loyal to her. Why should I be loyal to someone else in this palace? Each of us here are as helpless as weeds. <sighs> What's the use of a master? Wouldn't it be better to just help each other? <sighs> I agree with you. <sighs> All right. I'll help you. We should help and support each other. Go inside then. I just hope... the princess won't get mad. Since she's already asleep, we'll come back tomorrow. Please wait here. Chimian! Why did you lock me up? Chimian! Open the door now! Forgive me, princess. Even if you offered me a thousand tails of gold, or even ten thousand, I won't open this door. You are going against Chancellor Chow. Therefore, I must report you to Chancellor Chow. I am the daughter of the previous Emperor Traitor. Princess, given your position, we do not need to know who should or should not be a being in the palace. But as I've always said, I know very well. Once they get me out of here, you know the consequences. Even if they search for you, they'll never find this place. Chongxin's manner. I have something urgent to tell. Wait here. All right. Her fever has gone up. She just said she would like to sleep two more hours. Sleep for another two hours? Yes, two more hours. What's wrong? The princess still wants to rest. You can't wait any longer.
search for you. They'll never find you. Please leave now. Come back again. In two hours. We'll wait by the door in case she wakes up. Who knows? Maybe she'll wake up in an hour. <sighs> All right then. Stand outside. Do what you want, Mingwa. Chancellor. My name is Chi Mian. Uh. Don't move. Tell me, where is Princess Chang Shi? If I stay here, Chao Ka will surely have me arrested. You want to find the princess and deliver her yourself. You want to take credit for it. <laughs> Why don't we talk about it? I will share whatever rewards I will get. Well, what do you say? Huh? Agree? I'll ask you again. Where is Princess Chan Shi? You reject my offer. You wish to forswear your loyalty? <laughs> Since I'm committing treason, you'll be the first to die. Prepare yourself! She, 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 she's in the eunuch's room, the punishment room. It's in the southwest corner of the Imperial Harem. Lord Chongxin, I'm looking for a chapter to chat to. So far is worth it. General, General, General. 
General. I'm fine. This is just an old injury. It's nothing. General! I bring news. The warriors of the Shang family are approaching Soy County. Soy guards have already fled. Sir. General, let's depart. That's right, General. General, I'm willing to lead the troops. Jin Meng of Sui County is a valiant warrior. But the fact that Chung Leung has taken control shows how strong the Chu army is. The Shangs are slowly growing in power. They are attracting many others to join their army. If we try to subdue them now, we would be like a group of bandits trying to rob them. Taking control of their territories, it would be too difficult. If we go south from Yugu Pass, we'll reach Dingtao City. If we cannot pass, we can retreat to Xing Pang, where we'll have plenty of food. Once there, we set up at Dingtao and attack Xianlian. But General, why do we stay here and put our main force in the middle? What the general uses is bluffing strategy. You're pretending the main army's still at camp, yet you're doing reconnaissance while sending men to surround Ding Tao. Oh, that's a good plan. <laughs> my lord, you have read my mind. We have to study the Shang army more, find their weaknesses, and use those to exploit them. We will set a trap, and then lure Shang Liang out. We need to lure Shang Liang in such a way that he himself will go to Ding Tao. This time, he will be the lone bandit, trying to rob our shop. Lure him out? Lure him to Ding Tao? That's right. If he doesn't come to Ding Tao, who are we fighting against, huh? Right, Lord Sumashin? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> General! 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 It's nothing. It's nothing. Just an old wound. <sighs> Wait! Stop! What are you doing? Let me pass. The princess is still sleeping. How dare you do this? Stop! Don't go inside! How dare you go inside? What do you think you're doing? Stop! Princess.
Resistance is strong at the city wall, sir. We haven't broken through. Understood. Go back to your post. The blood is no new. Why is it so hard to take him down? Let's stop for now. We can't delay anymore. Replace Yingbu with General Shang Yu. No. I'm not letting Shang Yu out of the camp. That nephew of mine's being too rash. Let him experience setbacks. It would be good for him. If we lose this battle, it would affect soldiers' morale. So we must win this. I understand. So please, wait a bit more. General! They have surrendered and wish to negotiate. Where's the representative? Five kilometers from here. Are you sure? Why would they suddenly surrender? They said they saw General Shang Yu's banner. Huh? They what? The general's prohibited from leaving the base camp. What is this banner doing here? I dare not tell lies. Dismissed. Sir! How no strange. Nephew! What are you doing here? Didn't I ask you to repent in camp? Uncle! I just came to prove to you that whenever Chin soldiers hear my name or see my banners, they will immediately surrender. Was I really wrong in killing those prisoners? Sir Fan, question. Between our soldiers and Chin soldiers, whose lives are more important? Oh, military orders must be obeyed. Yes. Uncle, I will return to camp. I am willing to be punished. Come to surrender. We hope General Shang Yu will keep his word and spare our soldiers' lives. We are honorable men. We will keep our word. You may leave. Thank you. Our attack on the city lasted more than a day. Why do they surrender now? My general, the city guards are strong warriors willing to defend down to the last man. But that all changed when General Shang Yu arrived with his banner. The enemy guards were so scared that they surrendered immediately, general. Word of what happened here in Shang City has gotten around fast. People know how scared the guards were. You may not know this, but Shang Yu is well known here. Everyone just stops at the sound of his name. This is all thanks to General Shang Yu. We may have lost more soldiers out there. If not for what we did, General. General Shang Yu must be rewarded. General Shang, do you agree to kill prisoners? Yes. If it will lessen losses in our troops, well, I don't see why not. I do not think it is moral. Please explain. The Chen soldiers aren't as strong as they used to be. Back in the previous Emperor's reign, but despite that, they are definitely not weak. They may surrender in fear to Shang Yu now. But soon, we will arrive in cities where brave men are willing to fight to their deaths. What are we going to do? Keep killing everyone who refuses to surrender? This may not seem like an important matter, but isn't the aim of the Chu army to seek justice and defeat the cruel Chen? As long as we have the people's support, we will win. This is not just about winning, but also about humanity. If the people don't see us any differently from the chip, we won't win their hearts. 
we will only make them fear us. And when that happens, how are we different from the Chin we're trying to defeat? I see your point, sir. General, if you're truly determined to destroy Chen and bring eternal peace to the land, you should consider what I have said. You should think about your next move carefully. Hmm. Thank you for the wise words. I have almost made a grave mistake. Generals, I propose a toast to the Duke of Pei. This is for him. Why, you may ask? Because he is our lucky general. His men may not know how to fight, but it doesn't matter. Because they can still win battles. Lucky, that's absurd. What's this nonsense? Are you tired of killing prisoners? Hey, brothers. We should propose a toast to them. Oh, yes, yes, yes. all right. What did you say again? Yes. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. Calm yourselves. You should not be saying that. Why are we celebrating today? Why do they surrender without fighting? That's because General Shang Yu does what he says. That's why they were scared witless. Yes, Yes, we may have soiled our hands. That's true. But they're the ones who are benefiting from it. How dare you, Chubba! Come over here! Yeah. For Do your punishment, drink three cups! Punishment, my ass! Calm down, calm down! Hey! General Lung, tell me, why should Chubba be punished? What he said was right! You're the one who should be punished! That's right! You should drink! That's right! Oh, 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 right. How dare you talk like that! <laughs> in camp, you will all be punished. Get out! staring at. Continue drinking. Go drink. Let's drink. Come on, let's drink. It's good they fought. Hopefully they won't pick on us again. Oh, Lord Chow. Yes. He called me his brother today. Does that mean he sees me as a sworn brother? Brother? Yes. I don't think so. He said it very seriously. Not casually? Oh, no. I don't think it's possible. Think about it. You're from different backgrounds, right? He's a nobleman in a family of generals. And you? You're a commoner. Before this, you were just the village constable. <laughs> and then you rebelled and became the king of mountain bandits. The man is up there. You're way below him. Lord Chow. I want to be sworn brothers with that man. Think about it. If that happens soon, the Chu will not bully us again. If we succeed and make it big someday, he won't do anything to us. But if we get into trouble someday, he has to come to our aid. So I want to become sworn brothers with him. Don't you think that's helpful to us? My lord, it's not a bad idea. But be sure of what you're getting into. Let's go. This is not just wishful thinking. After all, we don't know if you agree to it. Huh? Why not?
are you looking at? Hey, when the Chin soldiers heard our General Shang Yu's name mentioned, they lost all bravado. Look, we haven't trained for days. No need to train. As long as General Shang Yu is here, the Chin soldiers will lose the war. You're right. The Chin soldiers are afraid of death. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Look at that weirdo. Henshin! 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 What are you doing? Stop acting like a fool and come eat. Shin. I suspect Zhang Han has a plan. If I am wrong, I'm willing to be punished. Speak up. General, this is Ding Tao. And this is Han Ku Pass. Zhang Han has defeated Zhu Wen's army and continued south. If he did not go that direction, he should have returned to Xingyang, which is abundant in resources. If he advanced, he surely should have made Ding Tao their headquarters. But right now, he is neither advancing nor retreating and places his men right in the open. Why would he do that? Have you considered this? It seems you are familiar with the territory. Please continue. I think he is making a false display of strength. His purpose is to secretly send men to surrounding Tao. If I were him, I'd do the same. Focus on being a good soldier. Don't let your imagination run wild. Reward him with ten tails. Yes, sir! General, have you thought of that? Here you go. General! Stop shouting! If you don't think it through, you may die a horrible death. Come on, crazy soldier. been, General. Apologies, I made you wait. <laughs> Minister Song, forgive me for being rude. <laughs> it is nothing, don't worry. General, attacking Ding Tao is truly a valuable service. Our king has ordered me to come and visit you in camp, General. <laughs> it is my honor. Please sit up there. No need, I can just ah. sit here. <laughs> All right. You've made a lot of progress after crossing the river. A lot of accomplishments, one of which is capturing Ding Tao. For that, I say congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. But in my opinion, while today is indeed a happy day, it is also a most disquieting day. Why do you say that? At this time, you should worry about your soldiers becoming too arrogant and complacent with a string of victories. This may lead to defeat. Lately, I'm afraid your soldiers have become lazy and conceited, General. It's not wise. You should warn them to be careful, so as not to experience defeat. After all, this Chang Han is an illustrious general who has won a lot of battles. Don't underestimate him. <laughs> An illustrious general? I've done a background check, and I found out he used to collect taxes. <laughs> the way I see it, his war strategies are not impressive. Look, right now, they won't dare attack us. The more cities I conquer, the more scared the Chin soldiers become. I plan to crush him without mercy, and before long they'll fail. His army will fall apart. 
the chin will be. No more. You are penetrating deep into enemy territory. I think before long, Dingtao will be a target for archery. <laughs> Forgive me, but I see it as a sharp wedge. A wedge that will be driven into the hearts of the Chin soldiers. <laughs> Shang Yu and Liu Bao have conquered Changyang. And that, my friend, is my second wedge. Dividing an army into two is not the best plan. The way I see it, General Chang Han did not even put up a fight in Changyang. Which means he deliberately gave it up. <laughs> now why would he do that? He's concentrating his forces to fight one battle. I have received word that Chang Han has been deploying his troops strategically. You took over Ning Tao in a day, but then what's next? I'm worried about you, Lord Shang. I'm worried too. For the entire kingdom of Chu. <laughs> you worry too much. <laughs> Even if he's concentrating his forces, we do not need to worry. <laughs> Besides, a good battle is exactly what we need. It's been raining lately, and the ground is muddy. How can he get here to attack? I think he is making a last attempt to defend Bu Yang. <laughs> now, when the rain stops, I myself will lead our soldiers to attack Bu Yang and end this battle. Lord Shang! All right, all right. I am grateful to you for your good intentions. <laughs> we both share the same goal of destroying the Chin. But please, when it comes to battle strategies, I think it would be best to leave it to generals, right? Right? <laughs> if I'm lucky enough to defeat the Chin soldiers this time, I will surely invite you to celebrate our victory in Puyang. Song Ye, I will hold a huge banquet there. <laughs> and you will be our guest of honor. Please, you're too kind. I heard you need an emissary to negotiate with the Qi Kingdom about joining forces to bring Qin down. Oh, uh, I would be honored to try for that. Thank you. I will entrust you with that mission. Uh. Why did Borneo Flake save you? Well, you see, Junction is a very righteous man. He's willing to help General Chang and I. And Dr. Chang seems to be a trustworthy person, don't you think so? I hope so. You were born into a privileged and sheltered environment, Your Highness. So you're naturally a trusting person. But in the palace, there is danger everywhere. I may know more about these things than you. It is the same everywhere in the world. The Chin court is so ruthless. Even the Emperor is under house arrest. Push something too far, and it will push back. Doesn't that sound like what's happening here? I don't understand much, Princess, but I hope things will go as you want them to. Princess, if only to show there is justice in this world. Listen, big changes are starting to happen. We should be careful with our words from now on. Mm. Your Highness, please go back and rest now. Your Highness. Please get up, Chongshin. Thank you. Minghua. Dismiss the other maids. Yes. Princess, do not worry. It's all right. They're not a threat. To be honest, Princess, Minghua is actually my younger sister. Princess, I can only stay here for a short while, so I'll go straight to the point. If I may ask, Your Highness, you have risked your life to save General Chong Han, right? That's exactly right. I hope you can help us, Chongxin. I am honored, Princess. 
tell me, how are you planning to help General Chong Han, your highness? Chow Kao. Chancellor Chow. <laughs> Looks like I guessed right after all. Actually, you might as well just say that you wish to assassinate Chow Kao. Lower your voice, Chongxin. Do not worry, your highness. The people in your manor who spy for Chow Kao are actually my people. They work for me alone. Even Chow Kao's own servants are working for me, too. Then you mean to say... What I'm trying to say is, if I want to end Chow Kao's life, it would not be too difficult. But to achieve the same amount of influence he has, that's the hard part. Princess, believe me, I'm actually just waiting for the right opportunity, too. And now look! You have just provided me with a golden egg. <sighs> This is dangerous indeed. I am doing it to save my husband, Chang Han. What are you doing this for, Chang Shin? Is it to save the Emperor's life? Or to restore the kingdom as it was before? <laughs> oh, Princess, saving the kingdom is a noble thing to do indeed. There's no doubt about that. But people who say these things are just all talk. Today, I will speak from my heart. I will be nothing short of honest. I am doing this for myself. Are you trying to replace Chao Ka? As the Chancellor, perhaps? Replace him, you say? I wouldn't say that. Then... Princess, Lord Chong, Chancellor Chao has just left his residence. All right. Princess, I'll take my leave now. Don't worry, I will be back. Excuse me. Princess, Chong Shin told me you can write to General Chang Han and he will make sure it is sent. Chang Liang sent Chang Ye here. Why send us instead? What's he thinking? What do you think? Oh, um, I don't wish to guess. We can't afford to dwell on that. We better hurry. Those at the rear, hurry up! Follow me! Move faster!
Shanghai. Two armies. Ding Tao surrounded. Huh? Ding Tao is in trouble. Yeah. 